So, Jamie, whenever I hear a song that my mum left me, I instantly shine on. So, this conversation, ladies and gentlemen, is between me and Jamie. Yep. Shine on you, crazy diamonds. Sweet, isn't it? Thank you, Jamie. The lovely welcome. man. You're welcome, Dan. So, me and Jamie <laughs> are basically brothers for many years, and me and Jamie are watching Baby Bowie in concert in 2003. But I can't show this to you because I will get copyrighted. That is really bad, isn't it? You get a struggle with that, huh? Yeah, sorry, but I, I get copyrighted for playing this song. And that's moody, in it? Why would I get copyrighted when it's my mum's song? I know, innit? My mum left it to me. Don't, don't people share anymore. Can't I share my mum's song? You know. Thank you, Jamie. Yeah, you're welcome. Ladies and gentlemen, the point of this is, when <laughs> my mum, when she died when I was 14, my Uncle Peter brought me 30 records around that she had when she died, and he gave them to me. And I basically have kept them, and I collect records now. And then 30 records... One of them was Pink Floyd, Dark Side of the Moon. One of them was The Beatles, Sergeant Pepper. And another one of them was Be uh, David Bowie, Ziggy Stardust. And obviously, we are play playing David Bowie now. So I just said to Jamie, Jamie, whenever I hear one of my mum's songs, it instantly makes me think of her and instantly makes me shine on. Is that right, Jamie? Yeah, man. Thank you, Jamie. You hit the nail on the head there. It took me a while to explain, didn't it? <laughs> yeah, you did, didn't it? But you know what I was on about. Yeah, when I hear one of my mum's songs, Jamie, it makes me instantly shine on. Shine on. Love you, brother. Love you too. And you make me shine on too. You too. True brother, shine on. <laughs>